I have the whole setup here to do pasanki, which is the Ukrainian Easter eggs, and I'm gonna take you through my whole experience making them. So first, I'm uh, boiling some water to put into the different egg dyes, and there's six different colors, yellow, orange, scarlet, light blue, light green, and black. And then I'm gonna add a tablespoon of white vinegar, and then we'll start dyeing. <laughs> So now that the water's been boiling, I'm gonna take the dyes, pour them in here, and then add one fourth of a cup of boiling water, and then the vinegar. Then we add one tablespoon <laughs> to the dye. start by sketching the design onto my egg. So there's all different types of designs that are used for these. I'm not a very good artist, so it's gonna be tricky, but we're gonna try one on. So now I'm heating up the Kitska tip until it's warm so then I can put the wax in. So I'm gonna take it and scoop some of the beeswax into the funnel. And then I'm gonna begin to start writing. God, it's so hard. the wax on it it was really hard I don't know why some of it is black and some of it's not but um now I'm gonna start dipping it into the dyes so for the first step it says to do yellow because you're supposed to do the lightest colors first I'm just gonna let it fall on the roll around really lighter. okay so now that a few minutes is up um we're gonna pat it dry so Ooh, a lot of dye <laughs> Don't rub. Oh. <laughs> okay, it says don't rub. We're not rubbing. Just let it sit there. So any parts that I want to be yellow now, I'm gonna re-go over with the wax. The wax is black here. I'm not really sure if it's supposed to be. But this is definitely a lot harder than I expected and shout out to all the Ukrainians who do this because this just takes a lot of skill. <sighs> <laughs> the next step is to apply green with the cotton swab. Kind of nervous. <laughs> oh my god, this is so difficult. This is definitely not gonna go in a Ukraine museum. <laughs> That's for sure. But I think that looks kind of cool. Next, I'm putting it into the orange, and orange is the only color that can cover the green, so that's why we're doing that next. So now I'm holding the egg into the candle to uh, melt off any of the excess wax. Away any of the excess wax. So you can see that part that I did, it looks kinda cool. Wow, we're gonna get to the rest. Okay, so here's the final product. It's pretty cool. I actually think it's like beautiful. I think I'll probably need to do it a couple more hundred times to get it down, but very cool once you rinse the wax off or wipe the wax off. I love it.